Ty here. Hola, amigo. It's Herc. What you up to? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm running some errands for the wife and kiddo. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt. So listen, man. Remember that time a couple years back we got hammered on party liquor, spread eagle? And I made you promise that if I was ever seduced by a super hot, super intelligent being of dubious moral standing who whisked me away to an exotic land, well, that you'd come and help a brother out. Uh... Vaguely. Well, bro, sis, you better buckle up because that time has arrived. Oh, shit! Herc, I really don't have time for this. But, dude, you made a promise. Do you even know what a promise is? That's like a sacred pact, man. That no hey, man shit, man. Come on, get you stupid right. gal. Herc, look, can whatever you need wait until tomorrow? I'm gonna go with the big N-O on that, compadre, because this is one of them uh, life-or-death things that I sometimes get myself into through no fault of my own. All right, fine. I'll help. Where do you need me to go? Uh, well, it's a little far. Don't worry. I get you here in the jiffy. What the fuck does that mean? Herc? <laughs> what the? Look, just hold on and try not to vomit. Oh, and if you got a six pack on you, go grab it now. Her, what the hell is going on? Oh, no, 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 no. Whatever you're doing, stop! Fuck this! situation is, uh, rather dire. But just head through the doors, man. I'll explain everything in a minute. Whoa! Whoa! What the...? Systems operating at 5%. What is this place, Herc? What am I doing here? Look, man, okay, there ain't always a logical explanation of these things. Sometimes you just find yourself, like, in a space station with little to no context or backstory. You just gotta fucking roll with it, man. So less questions and more movement, Nicholas, because if you don't save us, we all gonna what? die. What? Me? What the fuck are you talking about? I swear to God, I'm gonna whoop your ass when I see you. <laughs> Good luck. so happy to see you too now i know what you're thinking where's my junk but as important as the answer is to that question we got bigger fish to fry firstly let me explain what's going on you are now on mars welcome now imagine my arms are outstretched to comfort you during said revelation why are you on mars to save the earth man what from an alien invasion yeah that's right man an alien invasion now, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna be us who are doing the actual saving of Earth. It's gonna be mostly Anne. That Anne. The AI super being that Larry Parker would not stop talking about, you remember? Only problem is, man, these aliens took over the entire planet. They messed with her network, man, and she has come undone. Now, we need to get her back, man. So how do we return Anne to this beautiful, majestic, Earth-saving butterfly she once was? by finding energy cores and using them to power up all the terminals in the network, man. It's a simple plan, don't worry. Gotta get moving, though, man. There's a couple energy core thingies over yonder, man. I'll show you how this works. Go get them. Energy cores? Alien invasion? What the fuck, Kirk? I didn't ask for this. Look, I'm sorry, man, okay? But you're not the only person whose life has been turned upside down for far-fetched and highly suspect reasons, okay? I mean, look at me. If anyone's a victim here, it's me, the Herkster. Now, I don't want any part of this. 
I just want to go back to my family. No can do, amigo. We use that last bit of juice to get you up here. Besides, if you don't power up Ant's terminals, you won't have a family to go back to. That's it, man. That's the energy core. Bring it back and put it inside the terminal. So you brought me all the way to Mars to turn the power back on? Well, don't say it like that, man. You take all the pizzazz out of it. Control center restored. It worked! See? Nick, this is Ann. Ann, meet my bro, Nick. Uh... Oh. Hi? Nicholas Rye, you are Earth's last hope. And me too, right? An arachnid force millions of years in the making threatens your world. But with your help, I can stop them. Yeah, Herc filled me in on that part. We turn on the terminals and restore your power and stop the alien invasion. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Why do you ask? I don't know. Just seems pretty simple for something not so simple. You'd think there'd be more to it. No. It is very straightforward. <clears throat> okay, man. All systems are a go. Let's get down to business. You're gonna need to be able to defend yourself out here. You see the green barrels around here? Grab what's inside them. Now, I know it just feels like space jizz or something, but this stuff is magic, Miko. It's straight from the aliens. It makes all sorts of cool shit out here. When you're done, man, take some of your space jizz over that 3D printing machine over there, and I'll show you a cool trick. Voila, Miko! Welcome to the place where all your wildest dreams come true. Current designs are limited. The more you restore me, the more blueprints I can retrieve from the database. Here's a partnership. Now come on, grab my head, dude. We got work to do. Man, this is not happening. Get a grip, Nicholas, because your brain's about to go kablooey, man. functionality and help you on your journey. Oh shit, what was that? Relax, man, it's just Mars, you know? Wait, 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 man, stay off that dirt! Unless we power the antenna. Fuck me. I gotta climb towers now? Look, man, some stuff ain't as advanced out here as it is in Montana, for which I apologize, okay? I, 
I totally forgot to mention those space crabs. They live underground. That that one's on me, man. I'm, I'm so sorry. That's my bad. You're sorry? You want to tell me what that was all about? Man, ain't you ever seen tremors? These space crab dudes, they tear through dirt the exact same way. I'm telling you, man. I hope you got a good look, man, because they're the invaders, okay? They're the ones we need to stop. Anne was telling me that they're going to use her technology to invade the Earth and turn all the humans into food. Isn't that crazy? Exactly. Humans will become nothing more than food to sustain the arachnid horde as it spreads through the galaxy. Are you sure? Because, uh, I mean, they don't look all that smart to me. Well, they are. These little bastards, they've been playing keep away with the energy core so Anne can't get back online. So if we're gonna get those energy cores back, you can bet that these little bastards are gonna be all in our face about it. It's working! Antenna restored. Functionality increased. Excellent, Nick. Thank you for your assistance. You may now consult your map to locate other energy cores in this area. Oh man, those two blips right there? That looks like the spot where I was attacked by a big-ass space crab. I am picking up a signal from your gravity belt nearby. It will improve mobility, remove fall damage, and allow you to reach the transference center. No. No way, my space jets are still working, dude! Dude, my space jets are still working! Okay, let's go find them, man. Once you acquire the gravity belt, go to the transference center. What the hell's transference? Transference is the future. It's plugging my consciousness into a robot killing machine like I'm at 209. Transference is the future. Yeah, yeah, we get it, Ann. Oh, man, she's been trying to make me forget about finding my human body, so I'll just live life in a robot body. But I got a good feeling, man, I'm staying positive. Engaging door lock. Please wait. Oh, dang, is that... Is that my hand? Well, who else's hand would it be, dummy? Fair point, man. I'm just not mentally prepared to accept the possibility that something really bad has happened to my childless dad bot. My scans indicate several more organic anomalies. Oh, come on, are you serious? My body's in a bunch of pieces. Oh, man, how are we gonna find them all? With transference, you will gain the ability to detect such anomalies yourself. Done and done. Here and now, another promise is made. We will find my body parts and put me back together like Humpty Dumpty, because there ain't no point in saving a world that does not include my beautiful boot. I'm happy you will comply. Transference is the future. Okay, just like Ann said, we need to find the space jets I was using. Can't get to the transference center without them. Watch your step, man, and remember, the sand is bad. Damn! Looks like the energy cores are up there. We need to find those space jets. Oh shit, that's my pelvic area! Big ass space crab did me dirty! Chunk. Nick, 
Nick, where's my junk? Nick, you are lucky you've never had to go through this, man. Nick, I'm telling you, there is no worse feeling than thinking you found your dismembered member only to realize it's your peckerless pelvis. Come on, man. A little sympathy. We gotta find the rest of me, Nick. From my temples to my taint to my toes, man. All of me, okay? And then Anne can turn me into a real boy again. Herc, what you're saying isn't possible. No way, Jose. You shoot a big enough load of that space jizz into Anne's 3D printer and anything is possible. Nonsense, Herc. With transference, you'll become something greater than man. You will become immortal. Indestructible. You will be perfect. While there is truth to that statement, I gotta be honest with you, I am on the train for this one. I don't expect you to understand the joys of humanity, the pleasures of the flesh, the delights of the senses, the takings of a monstrous dumb. If I become a robot, I'll try to kill you, but I promise I won't. I'm gonna be a good robot, like RTD2, but with machine gun. cyber killing machine and fulfill my destiny or not approaching transference center oh man i'm starting to get real excited now i cannot believe that in just a few minutes i'm gonna be a cold uncaring cybernetic death monster it's gonna be sweet man it's gonna be sweet Okay, the terminal is on the top floor. You gotta power that place up before we can use the transference chamber. You fly like the wind now, little monkey. Monkeys don't fly, Herc. Not with that attitude, they don't. use the transference chamber. The two of you work working as a team will greatly increase our chances of success. Team Tad Bros for life! Put me in, dude! Put me in!
goodness, you did it, man. You did it. You avenged me and my wiener. That's brotherly love, man. Now put me in for real, and, and don't forget to take my head. <clears throat> we'll need it to complete the awkward human puzzle I've become. Channel now! Don't mess up my goatee. some theme music. yourself you're about to pop a bro boner here check it out your bad boy robocop here is fitted with a hole punch and lasers that these spacecraft don't stand no chance against and this sexy delicious rock hard body was built to last all kinds of physical and verbal abuse we are linked up man so you can just tell me where to go and i'll follow man i won't even argue like ever unless you say something about monkeys and if we find ourselves in a pickle and shit gets real intense you just use me man i'll draw these suckers away with my jaw dropping dance moves and such <laughs> 